KLZ interview, the options. At the bottom, we've got options, select that. We have a record tab, the editor tab, and the render tab. We're going to start with record. This is where we choose our audio format and one press on the right hand down arrow and you can select the audio format that you want your project to be. Select it once. Microphone input. I've selected microphone. These are the various devices you can hook up depending on whether or not you're running KLZ interview on an Android phone or a Chromebook or a tablet possibly even a Windows device. Line input, select that. Those are the choices that you've got for those devices. Maximum record duration. You can slide the uh, circle to the right to increase the maximum recording time. Just below that it shows I the f remaining free space and how much is required to, to record my setting of 40 minutes. You can s set your uh, show storage space as time by s moving this arrow to the moving the selector to the right and then that value changes to how much time in days which is one and a half days of recording time free start record in pause mode this is when you press record if you just want to get your VU levels this is handy for for uh, getting your VU levels before you start recording and then you just press the uh, record icon the circle to start recording I like this off save recording GPS location so anytime you start recording it'll record your GPS coordinates of where you were and the last value is reduce imported images to 1000 by 80 pixels and that's variable Next, we're going to select the next tab, which is Editor. And this is for the multi-track editor. W select your new project formats. Use the down arrow. And same as first clip, so every clip that you add will convert to 44.1. And the rest is just audio track colors, the normal track, if you want to use anything else that other than the device. Uh, Default, just slide your finger along the color bar and then use the, uh, your, your finger to, uh, fingertip to select the color that you want the default track to be. Just press it once to select another value. So you've got selected track, normal clip, selected clip, volume points, your volume zero decibel line, the marked region color and the cursor display. The next tab is the render. So your choices for rendering or saving every time you record audio or a project, every time you want to uh, render audio from your project, you can render to the database, to a WAV file, or an MP3. Prompt on overwrite can be on or off. Render audio music path, so it's saving to your device. This is where you can pick your fit your folder, and it'll remember. So here I'll just browse to my music. Select your uh, default MP3 bitrate, maybe 192, MP3 quality. And then you select your MP3 stereo mode. The difference between the joint stereo and stereo is joint. Um, in joint stereo, the left and right channels are used to form a left and right and a left right channel to be encoded. And that way, most of the audio, which is in the center of the stereo image, the left right will be bare and then it's easier to encode. So we recommend uh, joint stereo, but you have your choice whether you're doing actual music or voice.
And those are the settings for uh, KLZ interview. Thank you for watching.